Well, we're going to do a little rant. <laughs> I haven't done a rant for a little while, so it's, uh, I guess it's about time to do one. And I'm going to smoke right on camera. What do you think of that? I don't smoke very much anymore. Except I'm a little irritated right now. Coffee. First thing in the morning with coffee. After lunch and after dinner, I smoke. And I do my best every in you know all the in between times not to. So we're all going to die anyway, <laughs> one way or the other. Well, hello there. Yeah, she saw the camera. Come on. Oh, I guess I better hide. Well, anyway, and a couple of comments. I normally don't don't respond to uh, you know derogatory comments. That's your opinion, whatever. I have my opinion, you have yours. But both both of the people said that I should have helped him. The guy that got got himself in trouble over there, up in there, you know where he shouldn't have been. Well, I thought about going over there and helping him. But, if he wanted help, he'd have come over and asked me. I would think. Don't you, don't you think somebody, if somebody really needs help, they would ask somebody that was, you know, within 20 yards of them. This guy was, was determined to get it out. And I'll tell you what, that's a good thing. I commend him for that. Sure, I could have gone over there. I could have gone over there and backed it out for him and, you know, and patted him on the back and all that kind of stuff. And what did he learn? What did he learn by that? Except uh, every time he gets in trouble, somebody else will bail him out. That's what he'll learn. I can guarantee one thing, he won't ever do that again. Because he had to work to get it out. And that's the way I've always been. I Don't get me wrong, I've asked for help, you know, uh, in my life. But not until I've exhausted everything that I can do first. I was, you know, was told, well, you know, the guy was a novice and you're a pro. You should have went over there and helped him. You know, the reason I'm a pro, <laughs> pro, is because I helped myself. There wasn't anybody around to help me do this. I did it myself. And uh, there isn't one person that has spent any time in, in the forest or out boondocking somewhere that hasn't got himself into trouble sometime. Somewhere, sometime. Everybody does. Everybody learns from that. At least I would think that you would learn learn it, don't you? I mean, God. Now, I can tell you that if he got himself into real trouble over there, sure, I'd go over there and help him. Or at least ask him if he needed some help. I'm just not going to go over there and just, you know, go barging in like that and say, Hey, move over. I'm going to do this for you. I'm not going to do that to him. That'll embarrass him even more. That's just my opinion. And like I've said, more than once, I've got myself into trouble. Last year, as a matter of fact, I parked in a, in a spot. I woke up the next morning, it was a damn river right in front of my truck. And about two foot of mud. Well, I got to looking around, it was stupid. I shouldn't have pulled in there. I mean, it was obvious there is a wash in the monsoon season. Yeah, brain was disconnected. How did I get out? <laughs> Took me a while, but I got out. I had to go up around through the trees and, you know... It was just barely wide enough for the truck and camper to go through. I had to close the windows and pull the mirrors in, all that stuff, to get it out of there. But I got it out. I got it out, there, out of there myself. Yeah, I, I guess that's it. <laughs> I guess that's it. That's my rant for the, for the day, for the month. On, the, on a positive note, I went to Payson today. Uh, to get some of my scripts, and uh, I stopped and picked up the mic first, and uh, 
in a little while I'll, I'll put a video together showing that you know with the mic and without the mic and uh, I'm, I'm very impressed with it uh, I want to be free that was that was good advice on that one I appreciate that I really do so anyway uh, I guess I'll end this one I just had to I just had to respond I can't find the comment now, so I could respond to it that way. Otherwise, I'd have done it that way. But it look, what it looks to me like is, you know, or maybe YouTube did it. I don't know. Uh, it made the comment and then deleted it so that I couldn't respond. <laughs> okay, that's it. I'm done with this one.